Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys. Whether you're swatting at pesky mosquitoes or sprinting from a bumblebee, we all try to avoid getting stung, even if it's just a minor discomfort or annoyance. But these stings can leave you in crippling agony and screaming out for mommy. Brace yourself for a world of hurt as we count down the top five most painful insect stings. Ah! The more you freak out, the more you get stung. Starting off the list at number five is the Western honeybee. These bees don't sting often, but are known to aggressively defend their nests if provoked. Their stinger will rip off and stick in the skin, killing the bee. A gland on the stinger then continues to release venom. Despite this, some people will get stung on purpose. Bee venom therapy uses controlled stings to treat certain autoimmune disorders and other illnesses like Lyme disease. The Schmidt pain scale describes the sting as equivalent to a flaming match head lands on your arm and is quenched with lye and then sulfuric acid. Well, that's awfully specific. Crawling in at number four, the trap jaw ant. Their name won't leave you disappointed. Their jaws are capable of a strike force that can exceed 300 times their body weight. The jaws aren't just used to capture prey. By snapping together off a surface, they can catapult themselves to escape danger. Their bite is powerful, but their retractable stinger is even more intimidating. The pain from a sting is detailed as instantaneous and excruciating. And if that weren't enough, it's also like a rat trap snaps your index fingernail. Ready for battle at number three, the warrior wasp. Known for its militant nest defense tactics, the warrior wasp is also nicknamed the drumming wasp, and for good reason. When the nest feels threatened, the group of wasps will drag their protruding mandibles across the surface of the nest to create a loud drumming sound. And if this doesn't scare off intruders, they can use their stingers multiple times. What does a sting from a warrior wasp feel like? Try being tossed into lava and you get the basic idea. Well, these just keep getting better, don't they? Or worse, as the case may be. Capturing the number two spot, the tarantula hawk wasp. Well, with a name like that, you know this one's gonna hurt. The tarantula hawk is a wasp that uses its sharp stinger to inject tarantulas with venom. This causes paralysis, and the unfortunate victim is either held captive in its own burrow or dragged into the wasp's nest. Female wasps will lay a single egg on the tarantula. After hatching, the wasp larvae burrow into it and feast on the paralyzed prey. That's pretty gruesome. The sting ranks at the highest level of the Schmidt pain scale. It's been described as blinding, fierce, and shockingly electric. A running hair dryer has just been dropped into your bubble bath. Before we reveal the top spot, here's an honorable mention we couldn't pass up, the bull ant. The bull ant will bite and hold its victim with its mandibles while simultaneously stinging it repeatedly. With each sting, it'll release more venom. This ant has the potential to kill you and is the most common species of ant where you're likely to be in need of hospital care following an encounter. Their sting is described as intense, ripping, and sharp. Here to bring the pain at number one, the bullet ant. When this ant stings, it releases a chemical that signals other bullet ants to sting as well. Each sting is packed with paneurotoxin, which blocks the synapse transmission in the victim's central nervous system. Excruciating pain uh, follows. Oh man, oh man, it's definitely worse than the tarantula hawk wasp. The sting of a bullet ant is not lethal to humans, but it can create other uncomfortable issues. These include nausea, vomiting, and an irregular heartbeat. No surprise it ranks on the highest level of the Schmidt pain scale. I know you're patiently waiting for what it feels like, so here we go. Pure, intense, brilliant pain. Walking over flaming charcoal with an eight centimeter nail embedded in your heel. Wow, that did not disappoint. If you're interested in a showdown between two of these agonizing insects, check out our episode on the bull versus bullet ant. Stinging victims and causing unbearable pain is what these insects do. And that's what makes them crazy creatures.